at 87 first alert as we continue to track showers across the area El Paso we are just now seeing some of these showers starting to pop up they're not hitting the ground just yet but let's look east first just west of Dell City on US 180 we are looking at a complex of showers starting to drop down into the area we had a complex of showers that were just to the north of Tornillo moved into Tornillo and moved out of the area so now Here's the bigger focus. We are looking at Las Cruces here where we saw this line of showers and thunderstorms start to blow up over the Oregon Mountains and starting to move more west. Let's go on and time that storm out for you. We got the bulk of it heading down to the south of the Oregon Mountains. Looking like most of it is going to miss Las Cruces, but this section right here is going to hit Las Cruces here in about here in about 30 minutes or so. As we took it to take a look at the hail tracker, we saw a little bit of possible hail in there, not too big, not making a severe criteria, which would be an inch or above. Let's go on and time it out for you though, ladies and gentlemen. This is about around six o'clock. We are gonna see those showers starting to spark up a little bit more. And then by the time that we hit 11 p.m., we are gonna be looking at those showers still lingering across the area and then must, 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 must much of them, I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen, much of them are going to die out as we go into your early morning hours, but fire back up as we go into tomorrow afternoon. This is about 11 p.m. tomorrow evening, tomorrow night, where we are going to see a repeating pattern where those showers are going to drop in and then die out as we go into the morning hours. But as we go into Monday morning, Monday afternoon, we are going to see those showers starting to spark up one more time, but it's looking like our highest chances are looking like they are going to be today and tomorrow. Highs in the borderland. We got the 102 in El Paso, 100 in Las Cruces, and 98 at NMSU. And, of course, we count that number at NMSU for the Las Cruces numbers. And because of that, we have gone up to 30 days of triple digits, 20 days for Las Cruces. And it's looking like the hot what heat word of the day is boiling hot. It is raining. We are seeing those rain, rainy conditions across the area and those hot conditions if it's not raining. As we go through the next seven days, brought to you by Mattress Firm, we are going to keep that first alert in place all the way into Monday. Monday looking very comfortable at 88 degrees with that 50% chance of rain. And then the rain chances drop off. As we look into Las Cruces, a little bit of the same. 91 as your high for your Sunday with that chance of rain and 50% chance of rain for your Monday at 89 being your high. And as we go through the rest of your work week, we are going to be starting to warm back up and those rain chances going away. Keith? All right. Well,